What is going on, Summoners? We're back here today with another Champion Deep Dive. Today, we're talking about Onslaught. So sit back and relax, because it's time to get into it. Onslaught enters the contest with magnetic and telepathic powers, reducing the potency of incoming bleed, incinerate, and shock effects by 150%. Also, his first light and medium attacks and his heavy do not make contact with the opponent. And his debuffs gain 50% increased ability accuracy against skill champions. But, if a personal debuff or the stun from the parry mastery is purified or prevented due to a debuff immunity, he inflicts a passive with the same potency. Now, when Onslaught's opponent's combo meter passes a multiple of 10, he gains a non-stacking crush charge. And when starting an attack, he consumes the charge and inflicts a crush debuff for 3 seconds. But, if Onslaught is struck by a special attack, his Crush Charge is removed. Also, when either champion performs a well-timed block, he inflicts an indefinite 15% potency Daunted debuff on the opponent. Daunted increases all damage taken during special attacks by the given potency. This maxes out at 10 stacks, and while it's active, the opponent's Willpower Mastery is disabled. Additionally, either champion's attacks have a 15% chance to inflict a Neuroshock passive, dealing energy damage over 12 seconds. Critical hits and unblockable special hits have their chance increased by 40% flat, or 80% against skill champions. And while fighting a defending onslaught, dodging backward removes one Neuroshock. This has a 2.5 second cooldown. However, Metal Champions cannot remove Neuroshocks, and while it's active, it prevents miss. Also, while Onslaught is suffering from a Shock, Incinerate, Plasma, or Cold Snap effect, he inflicts one Neuroshock every second. Additionally, the first hit of his heavy attack pauses all personal damaging effects for 1.5 seconds. But, if the opponent is not suffering from a stun debuff, he inflicts a daunted debuff, and the pause lasts for 10 seconds instead. Now, let's check out his special attacks. On each hit of his special 1, he has a 150% chance to inflict a Neuroshock passive for 16 seconds. He also inflicts 2.6% organic magnetism debuffs. This reduces ability accuracy and combat power rate by the given potency, maxes out at 8 stacks, and while it's active, his special 1 costs 33% less power, and is more likely to be activated while defending. Also, if the duration of his organic magnetism debuff is reduced by any means, it reinflicts itself as a passive upon expiration. With the special 2, on activation, he inflicts a 30% potency delirium debuff on the opponent for the duration of the special attack. And remember, when fighting a defending onslaught, this will reverse the attacker's controls while it's active. Additionally, on hit, he replaces all Neuroshocks with degen passes, dealing direct damage over 6 seconds and maxing out at 20 stacks. And on the first hit, the degen can trigger through block. The Special 3! At the end of this attack, the opponent will be inflicted with a stun passive for 3 seconds and 20 Neuroshock passives, along with refreshing all existing stacks. Additionally, this attack costs 4.5% less power for each Neuroshock prior to activation, to a max of 33% less power. Now, let's check out his signature ability. When Awakened, Onslaught gains the ability to block unblockable special attacks from skill champions. Additionally, his Daunted potency is increased by up to 33%, and for each non-damaging debuff or personal non-damaging passive on the opponent, Onslaught's special attacks gain increased block penetration. 
Now, let's take him out for a spin in the champion rotation. To begin, parry the opponent to start building your daunted debuffs. Don't worry if they get purified, since they'll reapply as a passive. As you're building your daunted, try to perform heavy attacks while the opponent isn't suffering from a stun debuff to keep your neuroshocks paused. And once you're almost at two bars of power, launch your special one to stack on more neuroshocks and inflict organic magnetism. You could use another special one, since these will reduce the amount of power used during the special attack. Then, just keep your neuros paused and build up to your special two to convert them into massive passive degen. And if the opponent isn't already knocked out, continue using your heavy attack to keep the degen paused until they are. Now, if you're up against an opponent who's consistently purifying your parry stuns, it's going to be extremely easy to keep your degen and neuroshocks paused. So, take advantage of those passive stuns when you have them. And hey, here's a sneaky pro tip. Try to cancel your heavy attack into your special after the first hit. That way, your passives start paused, making that giant degen tick that much longer. And keep in mind, those daunted effects increase the potency of all damage taken during special attacks. And that includes your degen. So, once you're ramped, keep those specials coming. Thank you for watching this Champion Deep Dive for Onslaught! And hey, if you liked the video and want to see more, click subscribe, like, comment, and share. And remember, we'll see you in the Battle Realm!